Welcome to our lesson on the nine layout. This is a lesson that's really very physical for your child and is going to really help them understand number placement. Before you present this lesson to your child, they need to have a strong grasp of the introduction to the decimal system, the second introduction to the decimal system, and even the 10 tray or what we like to call it the exchanging game. So make sure that they have a, an understanding of those materials before you present this. What you will need for this work is a large work mat. As always with all of our works, we want to make sure the child has a control of error and it's, it's comforting for them to understand where their work is laid out. This is our large mat, or you can use a large beach towel that would be a solid color though. You don't want anything with any kind of pattern at all. It takes away from the materials. You will also need a set of numbers. These are the traditional Montessori numbers from one to 9,000, or what we've done is printed off the Montessori print shop numbers and laminated them so they're a little more sturdy. You will also need the nine tray. That's what we call it in the classroom. In the classroom we have it on the shelf just like it is with a tray with nine unit beads, nine ten bars, nine hundred squares. Now these hundred squares we purchased from Montessori Education Supplies. You can get these which is a little bit more economical. These are 100 units or we do also have the beaded 100 squares. And then you will need 9,000 cubes. The purpose of this lesson is a really concrete way to help your child understand number placement, ones, tens, hundreds, and thousands. It also redefines for the child the association between quantity and numeral, and it's really going to help your child with concentration and fine motor skills. And this is another work that you can incorporate movement with. As you'll see coming up in the lesson, I'm going to have the nine tray sitting right by the rug. But if you have a child who's interested in learning about this but needs movement, put the nine tray across the room so they have to get up and go get the quantity. This is one unit. This says one. One, two, this is two units, this says two, one, two, three, this is three. And you can even ask your child, can you find the number that says three? This says three. One two, three, four. This is four units. This says four. One, two, three, four, five. This is five units. This says five. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now the importance of doing the nine layout first is they're able to see how a number gets bigger. This is six. This says six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This is seven. This says seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This is eight. This says eight. Now this next step is important 
and you'll see why. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. This is nine. This says nine. Then ask your child, what comes after nine? They'll say 10. That's right. 10 comes after nine. We're out of unit beads. We have to move to the tens place. Nine, 10. We'll move to the tens place. This is 110. This is 110. This says 110. One, two tens. This is two tens. This says two tens or 20. One, two, three tens. This is three tens. This says three tens or 30. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine tens. This is nine tens. This says nine tens or 90. Hmm, what comes after nine tens? Your child will say 10 tens. That's right, so we have to move 10 tens is 100. So now we have to move to the 100s place. And then you'll take your numerals out again in random order. This is 100. 10 tens, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten tens is 100. This says 100. 100, two hundreds. This is two hundreds. This says 200. One, two, three hundreds. This is 300. This says 300. 200, 300s, 400s, 500s, 600s, 700s, 800s, 900s. This is 900. This says 900. What comes after 900? Ten hundreds. That's right. Ten hundreds is one thousand. So now we have to move to the one thousands place. This is one thousand. This says one thousand. 1,000, 2,000. Now you can see that the kids are going to get a real kick out of this as we get to 9,000. This is 1, 2,000. This says 2,000. 1,000, 2,000, 3,000. This is 3,000. This says 3,000. 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, 4,000. This is 4,000. 8,000. This is 8,000. This says 8,000. 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, 4,000, 5,000, 6,000, 7,000, 8,000, 9,000. This is 9,000. 
This says 9,000.